Pretty much whatever question you ask me about farming, I'll say diversity is the answer. We've been farming in a way which is completely outside of nature, and we need to farm in a way which is in partnership with nature. Nature's first rule is diversity, and by choosing to ignore that for a century or so, we've created a whole load of problems. The soil life that we need for healthy soils all of those creatures require different kinds of foods, just like we require different kinds of foods to be healthy because our crops start getting sick. And so we try and keep them alive with chemicals, which makes the fundamental problem with the soil even worse. And that's another downward loop. And so what we're doing here is bringing in diversity into the crop field. So let's not grow wheat, let's grow wheat and beans or barley and pea or just get different families growing together. And then you bring the animals in, and then the animals cycle the nutrients, and little by little, you're just creating a complex system that's pretty close to how nature does things. There's different ways of working with animals in these biology-based systems. So here, the, the sheep have come in and they've eaten it all down, uh, which has done a lot of the work in getting the field ready for the next crop. It's recycled all these nutrients, it's feeding the soil, it's feeding the microbes. It's all part of that cycle. This is a relationship between soil, plants, and plant-eating animals, uh, which has been going on since the dawn of time. That's how these systems work.